Good afternoon and welcome to Japan to BB Raceway for 11 laps. It's sprint series number five. Here you see the grid set from qualifying. Mick up the front, followed by Slayer, Zambi, Kiwi, the front four. Ten cars line up in group four cars for five sprints with a mandatory pit stop and tyre change. Races two through five are reverse grid and we're waiting for lights here. And we go green in Japan. Mick, Slayer and Zambi get away from the line quickly. Kiwi creeping up behind Zambi already, running into turn one. The 90 degree left-hander with a big bang. Three wide into turn one. Nani loses out as Pagani comes through. Pagani and Kiwi side by side. Ketamines creeping up the inside, forces his way through, demands track position from Kiwi. Kiwi runs a little bit wide. Pagani almost getting familiar with the wall there as they come around the final turn for the first time of asking today for sprint series number five. Mick Slayer and Zerbi, the front three. Ketamine's the cork in the bottle for the rest of the field as they complete lap one. So Slayer and Mick out in the front. Slayer tucked right behind, trying to, oh, Pagani. Bad exit from turn one there as they go three wide into turn two. Kiwi and Nali up the inside of Pagani. Con from inside to outside shuts the, or tries to shut the door, not enough room. Kiwi, Nali, Con and Pagani. Fifth through eighth, all bunched up in a battle. Slayer's gonna look for the move here on Mick. But Mick makes the inside line his. Ketamine still running in fourth. Kiwi the cork in the bottle now between sixth, seventh, eighth, and ninth. After three laps of 11, so the mandatory pit stop will be starting to creep into the driver's minds. For the undercut or the overcut, Slayer is still right behind Mick. Zambi taking the outside line around the final turn, trying to get that drive down the start finish. Slayer and Mick side by side. And Slayer around the outside line again. A little bit of a tap with the wall. That invites Zambi to the party. Zambi firmly in the strip set, slip, bleh, <laughs> slipstream of Slayer's Mustang. We're out for the end of lap four now. Zambi just looking to close the gap on Slayer more and more. Not quite enough top end in mixed vehicle. Zambi right behind Slayer again. Ketamine's in fourth, Kiwi in fifth, Nali in sixth. Zambi disappears, he takes a dive into the pits at the end of lap five. And Slayer still behind Mick, looking for a way around. Bumper to bumper, they go into turn one. For the sixth time of asking, but Mick with the inside line every time. Slayer, a little bit of a spark on the wall again. So approaching halfway in this race. It's Mick from Slayer, from Ket, from Kiwi, from Nali, from Pagani, from Rick, from Khan. As we see a mass dive into the pits there from five drivers. Kiwi the only one that stays out, so Kiwi still to pit. And Rick comes flying into the pits as well. And let's see where Zambi comes out on the undercut. Kiwi and Con, followed by Zambi in third. Zambi closing the gap on Con. I think Con still needs to pit here, so does Jonesy. Unless Jonesy's already served. Kiwi's in now. Lots of overlapping going on. Mick's come out. And he's being slowed down by Con. Zambi's got Slayer on the pit exit. It's Con, Mick, Zambi, and Slayer Freak. One, two, three, four. Four laps to go. Mick looks for the inside line on Con. Con runs wide. That, that invites Mick through into first position. There's Zambi on the inside line as well. A little bit of a tap, but he had enough space to get through. All of a sudden, Con is lurking behind Mick as well. Here's Slayer coming to the party. Con's really shook things up in this first race. And it's Zambi from Mick, from Con, from Slayer, the front four, with three laps to go. Slayer Freak, bumper to bumper with Con. 
Mick closing the gap on Zambi. Two and a half to go. Con serves now. It's really opened up a gap between Slayer and Mick in third and second. Ketamines defending from Kiwi. Here comes Kiwi with two laps to go. Mick looking for the inside line on Zambi. Zambi still manages to stay in front of the Horizon. This is going to come down to a one lap battle for first position. Slayer comfortable in third at the moment. Kiwi's managed to get around Ket. Mick and Zambi are going to go side by side with one lap to go. Hold your breath. Zambi just shuts the door into turn one. Almost side by side again, look at this. A little bit of a lap tap. Mick goes from the inside line to the outside line. One turn to go. Does Zambi have the legs? Zambi and Mick side by side. It's gonna be a photo finish into the slipstream. And there you have it, checkered flag for Dan Zambi. Mick in second, Slayer in third. And the rest of the pack come along. So we'll flick to the points now. And then we'll take you to race number two. What a start. Cheering. Celebrations in the pit lanes from the podium drivers. So Dan Zambi takes the max damage on 17 points. Mick second on 15. Slayer in 13, also to a good start. Kiwi on 12. Ketamine on 11. Pagani on 10. Gnarly on 9. Jonesy on 8. Rick in, se in 7 points. And Con on 6. So... After one race, we go to a reverse grid starting order for race number two. And here it is, we go to Tokyo, so we stay in Japan. It's the south inner loop of the expressway. Four laps. And again, reverse grid, so here it is. After race one, we have Con, Jonesy, Nali, Pagani, Ketamimes, Waitu Kiwi, Slayer, Mick, and Zambi at the back. So we're waiting for lights here in Tokyo. And we're off and racing. Slayer with a false start, lets Zambi through straight away. Gets left for dead off the grid. Con with a great start, gets away from Ketamine side by side with Jonesy as they approach turn one. Two and three wide. Relatively clean start here at Tokyo. Notorious for having not a lot of room to do anything. And the slipstream slim, sloop, sloop, the slipstream train flies down the first of the long straights. Into the big wide long hairpin section. Mick caught between Nali and P P Pagani and Zambi. Con still out in the lead, closely followed by Ket. Jonesy in third. Very, very tidy start of the race. That's Pagani in fifth, right in front of Zambi, Kiwi and Mick. Ketamine's right on the tail of Con into the tunnel. Two by two by two, they all go through and everybody's in the slipstream in pairs as they approach the Hairpin with the pit exit, with the pit entry for the first time. Four opportunities to pit this lap. Will anybody come in lap one? Ket runs wide, can't get Pagani, Kiwi. Oh, messy, messy hairpin for the first time. Con and Ket get away cleanly from the chaos. Jonesy's in third now as a result of all of that. Kiwi in fourth, Slayer in fifth, Pagani's dropped back to sixth. Gnarly in seventh, and one or two drivers serving a pit stop as Ketamimes still right behind Khan at the end of lap one. With one turn to go. A great wall of Khan out in front. Followed by Ketamimes, and then a gap to Jonesy, and then a gap to Kiwi. After one lap of four here in Tokyo. So Jonesy leads Kiwi, Slayer, and Pagani across the line. Kiwi and Slayer 
about to battle it out around turn one. As Ket pulls out of cons. Slipstream now and they go side by side. Ketamim ma makes the move, takes first position. Wait for it though, coming into here. Con's got the inside line. And Ket easily shuts the door on Con. Con leaves lot, plenty of room as they come through the technical section. And Kiwi's moved up into third. He's got Jonesy. Followed by Slayer in fifth, Pagani in sixth, Gnarly in seventh, and Dan Zambi in eighth. To Kiwi, poor run through that corner as Jonesy takes his position back. Slayer's joining the party as well as they enter the tunnel. Not a lot of room through here. Driver's really maximizing the racing line, getting as close to the walls as possible. Kiwi is going to look for the move there around Jonesy. Jonesy backs out, or was there contact? And Slayer comes up the inside, so does Pagani. And two overtakes into the hairpin. Is anybody going to take the pit option now? As Kiwi flies into the pit, so does Pagani, Jonesy, and Nali. Zambi in eighth position in the Bicani, the Bacardi Lamborghini. Comes around into fourth. As the drivers in front of him that did pit will exit now. Ketamim's still holding Con off. Con's managed to stay with him for the whole lap. Slayer in third with space and daylight. Zambi still has to pit, he's in fourth. Followed by Kiwi, Pagani, Nali, Jonesy and Mick. So at least half of the field have served their pit stops now. With two laps to go. Look at that Con and Ket, bumper to bumper. Around turn one. Expect a lunge from Con here as they fly down the hill and Con's in the slipstream. Decides on the outside line. Is he gonna outbreak Ket or will Ket defend? They both take a very wide line. And Ket just pulls away. Starts to build that gap on Con again. But he hasn't escaped the slipstream yet. Kiwi Pagani Zambi. Kiwi bumped a little wide from Pagani, but they all file back into order. and the Mustangs performing quite well here at Tokyo, but all eyes on, what is it, the Hyundai and the Mercedes out in front. Ket and Con. Con's still right there with him. Do either of them pit now side by side into the, into the hairpin? They both fly in side by side into the pit window. <coughs> Very wide lines. And Slayer comes through into the pits as well. So does Zambi, does he come through or will he pit? Zambi's gonna stay out, he's gonna come in on the last lap. Just comes out in front of Slayer. The oddity with this track of the pit lane not being on the start finish allows the final lap pit here. Con still pushing. Behind Ket. As they cross the start finish for the penultimate time. Bumper to bumper. <coughs> Pardon me. So side by side now into the final turn for the last time of asking. Con's got the inside line. Ket's going to try the switch back and sit in the slipstream now all the way down the hill. These two have been within a length all race long. Con with the inside line into the second turn. The big, long, wide hairpin. Ket runs wide, runs out of road. Looks to get the switch back done, but no, Con shuts the door. The 
tension, the drama. Ket runs wide, contact with the wall. Still in the slipstream of Con. Half a lap to go. Con's just pulling away in the tunnel a little bit. Can Ket close the gap and make the move? Is it gonna happen through the hairpin? Pop your ears, the pressures is rising, ladies and gentlemen. Does Ket dive? He takes the outside line. Is he gonna go for the switchback? Con's still there. He's only got one sector to get the job done. Into the high speed chicane section of the final part of the track. A little bit of contact, a little bit of rubbing from both cars. Final turn. Con breaks early, there's ghosting. And Ket comes straight through. Now Con serving penalty. That's obviously what he was up to. Trying to serve his pen on the final turn. And Ket serves as well, but takes the check and flag. Slayer pulls through at the last moment in second. And Con drops down to third after battling all day long with Ketamemes out in front. What does that mean for the standings after two races? Let's find out as Mick comes across the line in ninth to finish it off. So after two races, Ketamemes on 28 points. Slayer Freak, Slayer Theek on 28 points as well. Con on 19. Kiwi on 24, Pagani on 21, Gnarly on 19, Dan Zambi on 26, two points off the lead, Jonesy on 16, and Mick on 22. So three races to go, plenty of time to mix things up. Thank you for joining us. I love all of you. I appreciate all of you so much.